never know what you're going to run into when you uh, step into your camper and you've got to cross some rough roads. Um, I've cleaned up a little bit of it already, but you see that whitish spot right there on the rug? Well, when I came inside, my cat had just run across into the living room. I'd opened everything up and it was green sort of in this area, kind of a greenish liquid. And I'm like, you did not just wet this rug. I actually accused the cat of using the rug as a litter box. <laughs> but, uh, um, that's not what happened. So I got to looking, the uh, green area sort of extended across over here and what I saw was <laughs> green dishwashing liquid all around here it was actually dripping from under there and so yeah now I've got to um, look in the cabinet and see what kind of nasty mess I have in my cabinet. <laughs> and here's the cup. This bottle was full a little bit ago. So see how much has come out of it. Thank you, Great Value Ultra Dishwashing Liquid. And it always and, and the for some somehow the lid on it uh, became open and that's how it leaked out. So <laughs> I may need to get a flashlight. Okay, so let's just take a look and see what's going on here. The dishwasher liquid was on the top shelf. That's okay. That's okay. Um, I've got this little... Oh, I'll put it up here. This little wire basket. It's, it's actually a wire shelf. And it's turned sideways, so it, it kind of keeps everything in there like it should be. But... Obviously, it didn't keep very much in there like it should have. So I just gotta uh, go ahead and take this stuff out. I'll put it up in top. And I have another bottle, and but luckily, you know, this bottle was already mostly empty, but um, it got nasty. No. Well, at least it's not like oil. <laughs> And at least I'll get a good cleaning out of this. I'm just going to go ahead and um, take this rack out of here. That'll be easier. Ugh. Nasty. Alright, so you can see um, all back in here, this is soap going all in there. I've got one more bottle to get out. Clean up that nasty mess. So I better get doing, get, you know, get going. <laughs> and again, you never know what you're gonna find because your house is moving down the road, and your things are always shifting. I'm afraid to open my cabinets to find out what I may have up there. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully everything will be okay. And I have had things fall out of my refrigerator before. So you got to be real careful about things moving around and getting on rough roads. Sometimes you can't help it. But anyway, <laughs> lesson learned or as you as more appropriate accidents happen, you just got to go with the flow like we always do. So I decided to check down on the second shelf. There was still a bunch of items down there and I just wanted to see if um, maybe they got grip, dripped on um, because of this little hole right down here. And yes, it did. It dripped down all the way back. Right, right back, back here. And on the floor down here, you can see it is all my other stuff had dish soap all over it 
And folks, this is a <laughs> this is just regular dish soap. It's like Dawn, um, the ultra stuff. You know, it's the really concentrated stuff. And so it's gonna be a big bubbly nasty mess trying to get off get all this cleaned off and it's <laughs> it's not good. <laughs> I can just imagine soap bubbles piling up in the gray tank as we speak. <laughs> but the good thing is where we're staying right now, we have full hookups and Paul has already hooked up the sewer. So let's hope, I'm gonna tell him, go ahead and just open up that, uh, the grace tank for the kitchen and we'll be good, <laughs> hopefully. I got everything cleaned up. All my cabinets down here are nice and clean. And I did a little bit of reorganization. And instead of using this little wire shelf to hold everything in, um, luckily I had a, um, an extra, a couple extra containers. And so I just, um, it, it would, it fit right nicely right there. So I just put that there and then, um, put my stuff, my liquid stuff in it. And so now if it turns over, if it does, it won't spill and run only my cabinet. And then down here, I'm using a basket to uh, put my other stuff in. So it pays to have containers to stick in your cabinets to keep your all your liquids and everything organized. And I'm sure I'm not the first person to figure out this idea. <laughs> See y'all later. Thanks for watching our video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel, The Go With The Blow Couple. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram. Bye, y'all.